విదేశాల్లో ఎంబీబీఎస్ గుడ్ ఆఫ్టర్నూన్ డియర్ స్టూడెంట్స్ అండ్ పేరెంట్స్ ఐఎమ్ లావణ్య ఫ్రమ్ మెడికల్ అబ్రాడ్ కన్సల్టెంట్స్ యాజ్ యూ నో ఆల్ ద స్టూడెంట్స్ హూ గో అబ్రాడ్ ఫర్ ఎంబీబీఎస్ వెన్ దే కమ్ బ్యాక్ టు ఇండియా దే హ్యావ్ టు రైట్ దేర్ ఎంసీఐ స్క్రీనింగ్ ఎగ్జామ్ వెన్ యూ నోటీస్ ఎంసీఐ స్క్రీనింగ్ పాస్ పర్సంటేజ్ ఇస్ వెరీ లో బికాస్ ఆఫ్ నో ప్రాపర్ ఫౌండేషన్ ఫ్రమ్ ఫస్ట్ ఇయర్ ఆన్వర్డ్స్ సో ఫర్ అవర్ మెడికల్ అబ్రాడ్ స్టూడెంట్స్ వీ హ్యావ్ స్టార్టెడ్ అ ప్రోగ్రామ్ క్యాంపస్ కోచింగ్ ప్రోగ్రామ్ విచ్ ఇస్ వెరీ మచ్ యూస్ఫుల్ ఫర్ ద స్టూడెంట్స్ so this we do it from the first year onwards so that they get a better foundation from first year onwards for each subject so in this regard like we have uh, you can see this is belarus gomel state medical university here there are students of first year and second year who have already gathered in the classroom for online classes we not only take a, uh, conduct campus coaching classes simultaneously we give them online classes during their vacation they have a vacation from 28th january to 6th february which we don't want to while away so we have conducted these classes online e classes from india hyderabad you see belarus is 5600 kilometers away from here but still we are conducting online classes for the benefit of medical abroad students Do you want to give a sympathetic drug or a parasympathetic drug? A patient is an asthmatic patient. Severe breathlessness he is having. Do you want to dilate his bronchus or constrict his bronchus? What do you want to do? Good. You want to dilate. So for dilation, you want to give a sympathetic drug or parasympathetic drug? Sympathetic or parasympathetic? sympathetic bronco dilation is feature of sympathetic drug so sympathetic system so you give drugs which will activate our sympathetic system which is the largest of all carpal bones largest carpal bone the largest carpal bone is capitate the largest carpal bone is here so these are important tissues we have first one most first of all the alignment should be learned properly that reason we have the atrial systole here so please understand that atrial systole only helps in squeezing the remaining 20% blood from the left atrium into the left ventricle clear with this so the atrial systole the atrial contraction the atrial contraction of the atrial systole will come in the last it will contract the left atrium it will contract the left atrium and squeeze out the remaining 20% blood into the left ventricle Okay, any substance any any chemical substance it is drugs uh, especially the allopathic drugs are made up of chemicals and the origin if you see the origin might be the chemical source or natural source again in natural you have plants plants and the first topic we are going to look into is sulfonamides cotrimoxazole and quinolones do you guys have any idea what exactly these are sulfonamides cotrimoxazole and quinolones okay we'll go into these three topics all of these three are antibiotics in nature okay all of them are antimicrobial agents we'll go to the first one right now that is just sulfonamides when i talk about sulfonamides please remember this is like the greatest 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 grandfather of all the antibiotics the first antimicrobial agents that were known are sulfonamides only fruity if you remember if you are drinking a fruity so in the starting you don't have to squeeze the bottle why don't you have to squeeze the bottle because you already know because it is full it is full it is full of the juice so you don't have to squeeze it okay okay so the movements of git okay you can divide the movements of git into the movements of git you can divide into something called as the first thing will be deglutition only for the 20% which is an active process blood will be flowing clear with this and this important need of this 20% is fed by your body in condition example i told you a simple condition called as exercise i hope you got this point okay now we move on after this we have 
See, what is happening is when the uh, left atrium is contracting everyone, when the left atrium, I told you know, like 20% of the left atria is contracting. When I say the left atria is contracting, when I say the left atria is contracting, don't you think the pressure is going up or down? Yeah, with and lot of patience he has given regularly all these classes, continuous sessions. Yes, mm -hmm. Even pathology and pharmacology classes are also very nice, like, uh, we can understand. So you put it all together, here we can uh, get the points of anatomy, physiology, everything together. Yeah. And it would be nice if we get some regular classes. You want regular classes? Huh? <laughs> Yeah, yeah. Yeah, yeah. But uh, that's what, let us discuss, like, because again, it should not disturb your academic session also, so let us plan. His senior student, uh, Mr. Ravi, he is an Indian student's president. <laughs> yeah, yeah. <laughs> yeah, Ravi, can you please tell me, like, how far these classes, because you have been monitoring morning session first year second year students and third fourth year pathology and pharmacology so what do you uh, say like how far these classes were useful both for the your juniors as well as your groups no, from my opinion this class was very much important and very much useful for first year students so i think this class was so whatever things which the students haven't covered from the usual academy Okay. So are being explained by our teachers. So okay. I, I hope it is very much used and even for third years and fourth years also as third year is very uh, difficult session from all six years. Yes. So they can actually and also very easy. So they can answer more than uh, how much they prepared or so this I hope this will be very useful. Medical abroad. Double nine five nine double one four five four five.